Tons of food, water and medicine have finally reached the struggling citizens of Lugansk in eastern Ukraine. Now, after unloading its vital cargo, the aid column is back in Russia. These are live pictures you're seeing now from the Russia-Ukrainian border. You can see the lorries there making their way back into Russia. RT's Maria Fanoshina travelled with the convoy through the war-torn region. It finally happens. After being stuck at the border for 10 days, Russian trucks with relief aid for eastern Ukraine start their life-saving journey. We took off from Russia's border city of Donetsk. It's right here, just 60 kilometers from Lugansk, our final destination. But the main road is very dangerous. There are furious clashes there right now. And this is why we take an alternative route a little bit to the north. And this is why we will have to drive at least 100 kilometers. And still, it's not completely safe. The road twists through picturesque pastures. The image of vehicles snaking through the horizon looks so peaceful. But we are in the zone of a large-scale military operation. There are checkpoints at every crossroad. Armed men and military vehicles hide in the forest. They're anti-government forces. They're controlling this part of Ukraine and they are providing security for the humanitarian convoy that is now heading towards Lugansk. Midway, we suddenly stop. A reconnaissance group sent before us reports danger ahead. Two hours later, we continue, but we change the initial schedule again for security reasons. The road we had to take is a wild path. This is why we are now moving very, very slowly. In the villages we pass through, some of the few residents left cheer the sight of the cars. We are entering Lugansk now after more than four hours driving. You can see this black smoke over there. Shelling never stops in the city. For security reasons again, the convoy divides and the trucks enter different roads. We follow one of the groups. The relief caravan is welcomed by locals who have become thirsty, hungry and desperate during the days of hardship. Finally, the convoy arrives at one of the city's warehouses. Volunteers are here to help with unloading. The aid will first go to socially vulnerable groups and those who have been affected the most by the ongoing crisis in Lugansk, but also in neighboring towns and villages. A long-awaited humanitarian aid from Russia is finally now here in Lugansk. Tons of food, water, medicine and other goods that are sorely needed in the city that has been living under a very intense shelling for many months and recently without electricity or water. People of this war-torn region have been waiting for this convoy for many days. Marie Vinoshna Lugansk, Ukraine.